a volcano on the Indonesian island of Bali erupted on Saturday for the second time in less than a week, spewing a cloud of ash and halting some international flights. Jetstar, KLM, Qantas and Virgin Airlines cancelled some of their flights to and from the island, popular with tourists, after Mount Agung erupted around 5.30 p.m. on Saturday sending a plume of ash nearly 5,000 feet above its peak. Bali's Angora Rai International Airport remained opened and some flights were still arriving and leaving on Saturday, though thousands of passengers from the cancelled flights were stranded there. Agung earlier had erupted on Tuesday, sending ash to a height of about half that of Saturday. More than 145,000 people were evacuated in September when the volcano showed signs that the first major eruption in more than 50 years might be looming. But major activity failed to materialize, and many of those living in the area returned home. About 25,000 people are still displaced. For now, authorities have warned those who live around the 9, 940-foot volcano to stay outside a 4-mile radius. Indonesia's National Disaster Mitigation Authority said in a statement that it was still assessing the risk, but, Bali's condition remains safe. More than 1,100 people died when Mount Agung last had a major eruption, in 1963. Indonesia has more than 120 active volcanoes within its borders.